A very big hello to my all wonderful champions. I hope all my dear children are doing awesome. Well, I am here for a very, very, very important update for all those of you who dream about getting into the best engineering colleges in Karnataka. Well, my dear children, Comet K update has come through. And those of you who are not about, aware about Comet K, let me tell you, uh, you need to know about it. So we know there is engineering entrance examination such as JE. We also know about KCET, yes. So KCET is for the engineering colleges of Karnataka as well as for the other courses as well. But anyway, this is restricted to Karnataka, right? And the eligibility criteria also are pretty much specific. You have to be a resident of Karnataka or might have, you know, studied for these many years in Karnataka and so, 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 so. What if I tell you, you can still be a part of the Colleges of Karnataka by giving another examination, which is Comet K. And Comet K is not just open for the residents of Karnataka, but also for everyone who belongs to our country. So basically, everyone can write this examination, may get a chance to get entry into the top engineering colleges of Karnataka, such as RVC, BMS, MSRIT, and the list goes on. And most of us might not be aware of it, which is why this is an awareness video and also an update video because my dear children, Comet K has given their examination date is going to happen on Saturday, the 9th of May, 2026. So usually, as usual, every time it happens after your KCT examination. And with my experience, I'm telling you, most of the children who write KCT also register themselves for the Comet K examination because sometimes they might not get seats via KCET, you know the competition is a bit more higher. Now for Comet K, if you have a comparison with KCET, the competition is definitely, has definitely been lower. Which is why you may get a chance uh, to participate or to get entry into the college. Now, to be honest, yes, the fees is slightly on the higher side, but yes, it's also good to have an option. Okay, it's always good to have an option. So I saw children uh, who participate for, uh, participated in both KCET and Comet K examination and got an opportunity to choose. So you will also get that, have that in your head because it is super, super important. Okay, so do not lose this. We will come again with all the important updates about Comet K when the application form are going to start. All those things. Do not forget to hit the subscribe button for getting these updates and not missing out on anything. And please uh, be aware of this examination. Go through it, okay? The syllabus is going to be the same itself. It's going to be PU2 plus the PU1. And uh, yeah, so please, my dear children, make sure you go through it. And we are here to help you out, okay? So in our channel itself, you can find so many content around Comet K as well. Just have a look at it. Wishing you all the best and uh, be happy. Yes, bye-bye. Take care.